Thank you for allowing us to honor the patriarch of our family and the love of my life, Cole Lawson. Born Cole Livingston Blees Lawson II, Cole was raised in and has lived almost all of his life in Walterboro. His family has had a major impact on the man he became. His father, Cole Lawson Sr., was a police officer in Beaufort, South Carolina. His sweet mother, Queen Victoria Hires Lawson, and his stepfather, Ferry Jones, provided a Christian home that he feels blessed to have grown up in. He enjoyed a great life with his sister, Joanne Lawson Kynard, who, along with her husband, Clyde, has always been a valuable part of our support system. When Cole was in his 70s, he met his brother, Bob Doty, and Cole's two nieces, Vicki and Debbie. Because of Cole's height and athletic ability, he played both football and basketball in high school. He received an award for Most Improved and a watch for his accomplishments in sports. After high school, he went on to college and graduated with an accounting degree. During the last three months of college, Cole and I got married. He moved back home and immediately went to work in the Marine Base in Paris Island. He worked there as a civilian for 39 years. To Cole, the most important thing is God first and then family. He taught his children about God's grace and forgiveness. We would spend many afternoons with the TV off, gathered in the living room, and everyone taking turns reading the Bible. Then Cole would interpret anything our kids didn't understand. Cole taught his children that with God, all things are possible and that God needs to come first. Cole's mother was a guiding force in his life. She was a member of the Evergreen Christian Church and taught Sunday school for the young boys and girls class until she got sick and Cole took over. Cole continued to teach that class for almost 40 years. Cole has been a deacon, elder, and trustee at Evergreen. He has been a tither and taught his children the importance of giving to God what is due to further the kingdom of God. I never expected when I first met Cole when I was 14 and he was a good-looking, tall, 17-year-old that we would create such a loving Christian family. God has blessed us with three wonderful children who are always taking care of us and visiting frequently. Cole and I look forward to Thanksgiving and Christmas when our children, grandchildren, and great-grands crowd around Cole for family celebration time. Our family is extremely important, but so is our church family. Cole loves Evergreen and feels very blessed to have a family of Christians at Evergreen as an important part of his life. <music> Cole is and always has been financially responsible. He saved his money and paid cash to have his house built. He never had to borrow money from a bank, but made sure his family had everything they needed. Even after retiring from Paris Island, he opened a deer processing business and worked for years until he had a heart attack and retired from that. 
During his spare time, Cole enjoyed life by hunting, carving, and drawing nature pictures. He even became a taxidermist for a few years. He enjoyed Sonny taking him to different states to hunt deer, elk, and birds. Now Cole has to rest at home and can't attend Evergreen Church in person. Both on Sunday, but on Sundays, he is watching church service on TV. Cole and I thank God for our children and church family. We are truly blessed.